Hey, welcome to another video tutorial brought to you by LearnHowToScreenPrint.com. In today's video, we're going to show you how to make a vintage distressed t-shirt uh, design inside Photoshop. So let's go ahead and jump in and get busy. Um, we've got the design here. It's going to be a simple design, just uh, all fonts. And um, the t-shirt textures are all part of a, a pack that you can buy directly on our website. Uh, learn how to screen print com. So head on over there and um, we've got 10 different um, elements inside this pack that uh, can give your t-shirt design some um, interesting textures. So, all right, let's go ahead and open up the JPEG here. We've got a, a black background and a, uh, a white font. First thing we're going to do is to select the magic eraser tool and delete the black make this design a little bit bigger okay so let's go over to the layers panel here and we will go down to the bottom of the layers panel and there's an icon that says add layers mask go ahead and click that and now you've added a layers mask okay so the next step would be to open the uh, the texture that you want to use for this design and all these textures come as a PSD file or a bitmap TIFF Let's go ahead and use this one here. Let's check this out, see what it looks like. So now that we have this open, we're going to hit Control A. It's going to select everything and then hit Control C to copy it. Head back over to the, the design and uh, go down to layer mask thumbnail. Hit Alt and then click. And now that you're inside the uh, layer mask, hit Control V. That'll paste in the texture that we copied. So let's position this around a little bit. All those textures come as a high resolution uh, bitmap TIFFs or PSDs. So um, they'll uh, keep your designs looking clean and sharp. All right, so now that we've got that positioned where we want it, let's go ahead and uh, click on the layer thumbnail for the actual design. I'm going to hit Control D. That'll deselect the design zoom in a little bit um, since it's a, a white design on and the background is transparent it's kind of hard to see the uh, the texture applied to it so I'm going to hit a new layer drag that below the design and I'm going to hit control D and that's going to make my default color for uh, the foreground black white that's the background color hit X to us uh, swap those now I'm going to hit control delete and that's going to uh, fill the layer here with the uh, foreground color. Excuse me, background color. All right, so now you can see the actual texture applied to the design. And as I said, this is high resolution. Um, you could, uh, you know, uh, save this as a PNG, and you could uh, use it on like print-on-demand services direct to garment printing or you could uh, do the seps and use this for screen printing if we were to do this for screen printing uh, I'd say one maybe two colors um, this kind of depends on your actual printer and uh, how good you could hold your half tones Let me zoom in here so bitmap tiffs, um, they would make they make the uh, the negative spacing in your design. All right, let's um, let's do one more example from that texture pack, just kind of. Show you that um, different designs can uh, require different looks. Let's open up number 10. I'm going to hit Control A, Control C, or copy it. Hit Alt, click, Control V, or paste in the texture. Let's zoom out a little bit here. And position the texture. And there you go. It's more of like a traditional uh, grunge look there. Actually, let's do one more. So let's go ahead and delete this layer mask. Add a new layer mask. 
Let's go back in and we're going to use the first option. All right, control A, control C, I'll click, control V, and there you are. That simple. So in this pack, we've got 10 different textures you can add to your t-shirt designs. And um, yeah, each design will uh, require, you know, a different look. So uh, you've got 10 different textures to pick from. Head on over to learnhowtoscreenprint.com and uh, download it today. All right. Thanks for watching. Till next time, happy printing.